I'm an artist who puts emphasis on the aesthetic result of an artwork. However, I also see the process of making art as very important. So this year at Yuchong, I decided to experiment with several new projects that allow students to explore unique processes of making art. I was firstly delighted to have been able to share my own working process. As a plein air painter, I was able to show ECE as well as secondary students how I make large-scale paintings outdoors. Over the period of several weeks, students, staff, and the greater community of Kowloon Tong saw me obstinately paint outside the W151 campus, under the sun, and sometimes even getting caught in thunderstorms. Another unique project I was able to organize, with the help of my colleagues and the supporting division, was Paint Splash. Paint Splash took place during the secondary school's open day. Participants of all ages were able to dip sponges in premixed colors of paint, then throw them at canvases from a distance. This was not only an exciting, messily fun experience, but it also introduced many people to using chance in the process of art making. I then worked with selected students to respond to the splash marks while adding representational elements to the canvases. As part of the 80th anniversary photo contest, we wanted all members of Yuchang to celebrate through photography. But since ECE students are too young to enter the contest on their own, we decided to give them the opportunity to explore light painting. We set up a dark room and gave children torch lights with different colored filters. Together, we drew lines, shapes, walked around, and even danced to music with the lights. The camera's long exposures would capture the light's movements, and then the children were able to immediately see their creation on the computer screen. They really rejoiced over the unpredictable resulting paintings that were a product of time, the mind, the body, and of 